International Women's Day is a wonderful opportunity to champion women's quality and be inspired by the achievements of women everywhere. This year's theme is Break the Bias. So together with the community, we're reflecting on how equality can be achieved. In this video, you'll hear from some amazing women who are working to create a safer, more welcoming and equal city of Melton. We can all help promote quality for everyone by calling out gender bias, discrimination and stereotyping when we say it. Gender biases create unequal um, society. It's the right thing to do. It's not fair that women get um, different treatment or uh, um, have access to different opportunities than men do. I okay, guess we want a world that is fair and just and a world where everybody is treated equally. I think we should challenge it because um, a lot of women may feel uncomfortable about society and also um, pushing it out um, and then changes for the future, the future times as well. So and I believe now more than ever to the COVID, more and more women are subject to working from home and also taking care of their household duties. And it's highlighting the inequality in the house where men are just focusing on work, but women are doing and taking a higher load at home. So I believe now we need to challenge that. Well, gender biases create injustice and imbalance in society. I think it's just the right to do in society that is progressive. We can't say that we want to have an equal society and ignore the fact that there's a lot of inequality for them. And also, um, also like benefit the next generation so that they're able to have a voice, um, you know, as, as a mean as well. Gender biases. The mindset of people can be very hurtful. If we look at society, the more we have these gender biases, the more we're creating an imbalance and an unfairness. Our society will look a lot stronger if women and girls are treated equal in everything that we do. Women are so strong and I think realising um, the power that they hold in society will pave the way for um, girls to realise opportunities and to pursue things that they never thought that they would. You have a safer society, you are a happier society, you are a healthier society and sustainable society. If we had a world where everybody was treated equally, where there was gender equality, then it would definitely be a just and fair world. I reckon we would be more positive, also like a much more respectful environment as well, which you could have a sense of like inclusion as well between the two genders. And yeah, the overall would just be more positive for every which likes. It would be a society that would have less discrimination and less fear of harm for women. And the social constructs and cultures that condone violence would come to an end, I would say. Our community would be a paradise. This is the violence and sexist. Et toutes les filles et les femmes pourraient atteindre leur plein épanouissement, leur plein potentiel. Uh, free of discrimination and free of biases, we really re respected each other and work a cooperative way. First of all, celebrating women, celebrating um, the achievements of women, celebrating the success of women. Um, empower women to go for more roles as well. It could be in education, it could be in your workforce, or even in your school as well. Just and let's raise the society. Let's raise the kids and share responsibility. Parental responsibility. Sharing of the household chores to reflect and change our attitudes towards women. I think something that we can do um, to make sure that women and girls live in a community that's more safe and welcoming is really thinking through. Um, with any activity, does this include women? Like, nous devrions dénoncer les comportements sexistes, éduquer les enfants, éduquer prioritairement les filles, traiter les enfants de la même manière, et pouvoir partager les responsabilités domestiques au sein du couple. Create an environment, give them 
and environmental harm. Give the encouragement she, she can fulfill her dreams. Also changing social constructs and ideas that create um, barriers for uh, the unfairness. Um, and I encourage men to give for the examples to, uh, to their children. Right? For me, it all comes down to respect That's and right. make their policies more equitable for women to come into work and get the same pay and opportunities to rise up the ladder. We need to create a mindset from the very beginning how we treat a boy and a girl. Celebrating women's achievements is really crucial as well. 